At this point, anyone in the neighborhood who was sheltered in place is able to go back into their home and, and or business. And we have also um, opened up all of the streets around the area with the exception of University Avenue. University Avenue is going to be closed for a while until we can uh, get the entire situation remedied here and move some of our resources. And how long does it take to check all the levels inside a building this size? Uh, this is this is a fairly sizable building, so I would I would expect that we're going to probably be at this for another hour or two to uh, make sure that all parts of the building are safe before we allow anyone back in. And any telling what the cause of that leak in the tank was yet? At this point, I don't have any information on the cause. Uh, what time exactly was the leak contained? Uh, the leak was contained at uh, 10.48. We were dispatched here at about 9.40, I think it was about 9.45, so right around an hour total time that we got dispatched till this continued. Can you briefly summarize just the dangers of an ammonia leak like this? Well, anhydrous ammonia is, uh, it reacts with water and, and it causes chemical burns when it reacts with water. And so if you were to inhale that, uh, you get significant respiratory issues um, and even just the moisture on your skin it can cause a chemical burn with that. Were there any injuries that you know of? Uh, I am not aware of any injuries at this time, but uh, I don't have all of that information gathered right now. How much time and effort does it save you guys when a company has an evacuation plan and can execute it well? You know, every company that, that has any kind of, of chemical or chemical process like this should have a plan. Um, and it is a legitimately a lifesaver when they, when they use that plan and train on it. Uh, it saves us a lot of time. When we arrived here, this building has over a thousand employees in it. And when we arrived here, they were all outside already. We moved them farther away. Uh, but honestly, that, that's a sign of a company that puts a lot of uh, uh, stock in their people and takes care of their people. And that's what we want to see. It's very helpful to us. And when you all first responded and went in, do you have any idea of the area uh, that the leak was coming from or did you have to sweep kind of the whole building? No, it was very obvious where the leak was coming from when we arrived. Um, the, the ammonia coming out of the tank is a large white cloud um, and because it was an exterior leak, we could see it right away. And um, as far as the shelter in place goes, is that still? No, anyone that was sheltering in place is, is able to return to their home or their business. Uh, do you have any idea what their setup was? Was it an alarm that went off or was it more like a radio thing with the apartment heads? Or? Uh, I believe someone noticed the, the leak immediately when it happened. All right. Awesome. Thank, Thank you. you so much.